Let's check out the fun new goodies I just received from Planny Thing. Hey y'all, I'm Elisa, the Scrappy Wife from ScrappyWife.com, and I'm super excited because today I have some new goodies from Planny Thing. If you haven't heard of Planny Thing, um, there is a wonderful woman behind the name. Her name is Amber, and they are actually based in the Netherlands. And uh, Amber reached out to me to see if I would be interested in checking out some of her new release. All of these goodies release on April the 2nd. Um, I believe that's when this video is going to go up. You can check out her website. There are so many fabulous uh, sticker books. She is so good at themes and seasonal and she tends to have a ton of accessories that go with all the things. It's lovely. You should take some time to check it out if you haven't yet. But today I am going to flip through all of these new goodies. I think we have a couple of sticker books, maybe a notepad and some washi tape. We're going to check out the new release, see what these stickers are all about, and then do a plan with me at the end. So if you want to see some of these new release products from Planny Thing, Stay tuned. All right, I think I'm actually going to start with the washi tape. I love how this is all packaged up like a little present to open. So, oh my goodness, you guys, there is so much washi tape. Oh my goodness. Okay, so first we have this diagonal stripe look, which I am here for because... How versatile is that? Wait, let's, I'm trying to get it in rainbow order for you guys to see. I would imagine that this comes at a, as a set, but perhaps it also is individual. So wonderful. I love this size. I always call this, I'm sure it has like a exact name on the millimeters and all of that. I call this the medium size of washi tape instead of skinny. And then the regular size, I call this medium. Um, and this is a diagonal stripe with all of your basic colors. So, so pretty. Love those. Okay. All right. I see you, Amber. That's awesome. I love the basics on washi tape. That's kind of my go-to um, most of the time. And then this particular pattern has like a honeycomb. So there's um, a muted green. This one is kind of like a reddish brown. And then um, that robin's egg blue that we all love so much. Oh, I'm excited. Those are going to be great staples to add to my collection that I'm sure I'll be able to use a lot as I have washi tape rolling all the way around. So there's some fabulous washi tape available. Make sure to check it out. It's always fun to just add a few rolls to your order, um, just that are going to complement some of the colors that you're working with. All right. Then we have in this package, some more fun goodies. We have a couple of different sticker books and then look at this notepad. You guys, it's so dreamy. I want to live on a house surrounded by water like that. How beautiful for summer. Oh, look at that. It's double-sided. Um, Y'all, that's not really common. Most of the time, it's just white on the back. I love that it's double-sided so that if you do want to punch this and put it in your planner, um, then it's, it still looks nice. But you can also just have this sitting out. It's nice to change out your kind of standard notepads throughout the season so that you have a little bit more um, of a seasonal feel. And this is definitely feeling like you're going on vacation, but with a notepad. Love that. Love those houses. So, so cute. Okay. We have two books, Summer Fun, 1,100 stickers, and then Summer Houses, 822 stickers. Let's start with the Summer Houses because we just looked at some houses right here. Let's open it up. Now, these sticker books are sized a little bit differently. Let me grab a Happy Planner sticker book so you can see the difference in the size. All right, here's the Happy Planner sticker book so you can see it's wider. It's going to be similar to those wider sticker books that we have from like Live Love Posh and Kill of a Plan, but it's also a little bit shorter as well. So it's a little bit more compact. I love that. Okay, let's check it out. Plenty Things Summer Houses 40 sticker sheets. Oh my goodness, look at that. Oh, I love it. So over in Patreon, we've been talking a lot about going on vacation in your planner because a lot of funds are limited. We don't all get to go on our dream vacations all the time. 
but kind of playing with the idea in your planner, doing themed weeks as if you were going on vacation in that spot, I think is a really fun way to just play and dream in your planner. Look at those. Oh guys, these are beautiful. These are all on clear sticker paper. By the way, all the houses have been clear and then we have some functional boxes mixed in kind of in that same color scheme. That's cool. Oh, the blue, oh my goodness. That's so pretty. Now these are a little bit smaller. I feel like um, that's kind of nice because you can create several different scenes on one page. Oh, those are so pretty. Love the blue, that is like a dreamy color. Here's our houses, I feel like those are the same that we saw from our stationery. Absolutely gorgeous watercolor look. This totally makes me want to go on vacation. Oh, this house with the red roof. It's fun to dream of which one you would prefer to stay in. I like it. Oh, that's so good. And then functional boxes. I love that she mixes the functional boxes in. It's not just decorative on this one, which is fabulous. Here's our beach time, our beach houses. Living our best surfing life. Oh, the palm trees are super cute as well. Oh my goodness, look. Like a little downtown street. That. Yes, please. I feel like that would be more my ideal vacation, like wandering a cute little charming downtown area, eating at all the places. That's beautiful. Love the boxes that go with it as well. Oh, this is giving you like in the mountains vibes. You're visiting a vineyard. That would also be an ideal vacation for me. I'm getting all the vacation feels. Stop it. Those are so cute. Look at the trees. That is so fun. Oh, I love it. You guys, all of these are so charming. If you love architecture, I feel like this is a lovely way to celebrate that in your planner. The functionality, oh, fun, okay. Sunny day, ocean swim, tropical vibes, summer, summer. These are fun boxes, love that. Two pages of those, these are on clear. Let's go travel. Let's go to the beach. It's summertime. Hello, summer. Travel is always a good idea. Oh, summer, it's coming. It's still a little bit cold where I am. Enjoy the little moment of summer. Let's have a great summer. Those are beautiful. Gorgeous handwriting. Oh, I love it. Okay. I'm very much tempted to do a spread with those. This is the one I'm kind of leaning towards. Let's kind of see what the other sticker book has. I think that's so fun and interesting and different because the architecture is just beautiful. And like I said, a vacation in your planner, I'm here for that. Okay, the other sticker book releasing is Summer Fun. And this one has 1,100 stickers, 44 sticker sheets. Oh, she has got travel on the mind. I'm here for it. Look at those colors. I absolutely love that. I like the edges too, how they're not so sharp. They look like watercolor. Beautiful. Oh, tropical feels. All the tropical feels. Who's got a tropical vacation coming up? Let me know. I'm going to live vicariously. I'm definitely not going to the tropics this year. I did last year for a cruise. It was lovely. Love the functional stickers mixed in. Now we're on the deserted beach with the ocean waves. So beautiful. More palm trees to our heart's delight. Those are cute. With the sailboats. Very cool. And then our functional stickers that kind of go with the same colors. Love the size of her bullet points. I know that's a weird thing to say, but she has smaller bullet points, which I appreciate. Oh, look at the monochromatic, like the gradient feel right here. These are all your summer clothes, your summer must-haves. 
This would be cute to decorate a like packing list page. I would love that. Um, yes, please. With all the ice cream and the treats. Ooh, I feel like, let's talk about it. What do we think? Do we think we can mix in? Where's the ones I was loving? Yep. I think those can mix in and out with each other. All right, let's keep that in mind for our planning. That ice cream truck is too cute. Here's our time at the beach. This is giving me Barbie Playhouse. Barbie Dreamhouse. Barbie goes to the beach. Love it with all that pink. Bright colorful boxes to match. So cute. All about the grilling out. How perfect for like a Father's Day. Or maybe you're planning some barbecues, some, some neighborhood grill outs this summer. Look at the pool. Look at the, oh my goodness. My kids have had this exact float. I think that's hilarious. Oh, I love it. So, with the inflatable pool. Very cute. There's a ton in here. Oh, M G. I love these girls. I love those flowers too. How cute are those little girls in their summer dresses? I'm here for that. That's adorable. Oh, and you get more of them with their sunglasses. Okay. Those are super cute and different. Here's all of our camping, camping gear ready to go. Awesome. You guys, it's fun. And then some more functional summer day. Eat, relax, swim, repeat. You have some plan stickers right here. And then we're going to get into more uh, summer stickers, summer phrases. That's what I meant to say. Ice cream makes everything better. Yes, it's true. Summer. Those are, I like the writing. I don't know if this is Amber's writing or not, but I love it. Say yes to new adventure. Make waves. That's cute. Oh my goodness. Those are super cute. All right. So these two books release over at Planning Thing, April the 2nd, 12 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. There's all of these great washies that you can mix in. There's some great stationery that you can add in as well. And I'm excited to plan with these. I think I'm going to plan in my creative journal this time around. So if you want to watch a plan with me, stay tuned. Now I did forget to mention that I actually have a discount code available for you. If you would like to shop Plan Anything, you can use code SCRAPPYWIFE10 to save 10% on your order and every little bit always helps. We are working in my creative journal planner. I use the lined vertical layout for this planner. And what I do in this one is generally I write a highlight of the day in the upper box section and then just write out some of the things that happened that day kind of like a little journal um, and I love this because I love to get to decorate another planner spread playing with stickers is always going to be fun and it's just a nice way for me to reflect on the day I generally actually fill this out in the morning about the day before. So I'm kind of filling it out after the fact, but I've really enjoyed the process of just kind of reflecting on how the previous day went, some of the big happenings, all of that stuff. So we're gonna start out with some of that gorgeous washi tape. Again, that stripe is perfect because it's super neutral. And we're gonna create some little scenes with these adorable stores. I know that this was marked as the summer houses, but come on, those can definitely be spring. And I definitely wanna visit this imaginary little town that has all of these very cute downtown stores. I just think it's a fun, a fun concept to think through. So I'm going to do some of these stores at the top, some of the smaller ones. I still will have a place to be able to write the highlight of the day, but I definitely don't need as much writing room up there so I can take my time and have fun with the stores. I'm balancing out where I put the decorative stickers by layering a functional sticker with it. It can be really easy to get so heavy on the decorative side of things that you actually lose functionality in your planner. And even though this is a planner just for fun, I still need places to write. So make sure as you're placing down your decorative stickers, as you're creating these fun scenes that kind of just um, jump off the pages in these books, you're considering how this is still going to be functional. 
Now I toyed with whether I wanted to change the washi tape color at the bottom to bring in more color, but then I ended up deciding, you know what, if I stick with the purple, that will be a cohesive element because I'm using a lot of different colors of functional boxes, having some sort of element that is uh, present where all of these little shops are going to be, that just makes sense and kind of brings uh, the spread together just a bit. So we had the larger one at the bottom that just makes sense from a weighted perspective. We're gonna sit some of these smaller ones up top. You may also have noticed I used some of the circle functional boxes. That can be tricky. Sometimes circles are tricky. You have to make sure you balance them on your spread. So I have one on the left, one on the right, I want it to be even. I also put green on the left to balance out the green box on the right. Same with the long yellow box. It's all about finding balance in your spreads. And you can see with each uh, building that I put down, I made sure that it was kind of attached or layered with a functional box. All right, now I'm pulling into the summer fun sticker book and I'm bringing in some of those ice cream elements because I'm pretty sure in my fictional little town here, they definitely have an ice cream parlor and it's probably one of the most popular places in town. So we're gonna add these little ice cream elements, some little parlor uh, chairs and table, you have the cart, you have the little sign out front. I think these are fun um, to add just little details to bring the scene together, just to bring your imagination. Now here's my ode to the up house, can you tell? I thought that would be so cute, having all the balloons just kind of floating away from the house. It's just fun. Sometimes the smaller stickers really make the spread. Yes, it's fabulous to have big, huge stickers that cover up a portion of the page that make a huge impact, that kind of save you time. But adding the little detail stickers, I feel like is what elevates a spread um, just past your more typical spread. So I love that the Planning Thing books offer some smaller detail stickers that you can add in. All right, now I'm bringing in the ice cream elements. I want this one here, but I'm just gonna white out. Did you know that you can white out directly over the top of washi tape? Cause you can. So we're gonna add that little ice cream piece right there. And I knew that I was going to do the phrase, ice cream makes everything better. That was gonna be kind of the title for this spread. So we're gonna add this up here. I end up putting it down a little bit crooked, kind of driving me crazy that it's crooked, but that's okay. Sometimes it happens. You can't fret about that stuff too much. Plus I definitely didn't want it to uh, tear the page, but these stickers are pretty nice and thick. So I don't know that it would have torn the page. We're just going to leave it ever so slightly crooked and just um, accept that little bit of imperfection. All right. I'm looking for other places where I can add the little ice cream elements, making sure again, that they're spread throughout the page, not just clustered in one area. So this one we'll just bring in right over here. Now each decorative box also has some extra ice cream elements near it as well. All right, now just to elevate the spread a little bit more, I'm gonna change up the days of the week. This is actually a book I have from Hobby Lobby Paper Studio, Studio 52, something like that. The Hobby Lobby brand um, has a great uh, dated sticker book with uh, the different days of the week in different colors. So we're gonna change these to purple to bring out the purple washi tape. And then I'll take a moment to add the dates at the top and that will be it for this spread. I'm so excited, A, to be a Planny Thing affiliate and B, to play with these fun elements. I think these stickers are gorgeous. Make sure to check out this new release. I will have it linked below. That is an affiliate link. So thank you in advance for shopping. And don't forget to use that code SCRAPPYWIFE10 to save on your order. Um, every little bit helps and it's always fun to support other small businesses. I wanna give a huge shout out to all of my Patreon members. We just kicked off a whole month of organizing and spring cleaning and decluttering and all of the things with all of our craft supplies and it is certainly not too late to join us so if you are interested in checking out patreon and all of the extra content available over there you can find the link for that below all right i hope that you have a fabulous day and as always keep it creative <laughs>